The prairie pothole region of North Dakota is known as the duck factory of North America. But it's a common misconception that these sloughs and wetlands rely only on years with plenty of moisture. The prairie pothole region has certainly evolved on, you know, cycles of drought and, and wet periods. Waterfowl biologists like Andy Dingus would much rather see a wetland complex that looks like this rather than a much larger, deeper water structure. The longer a wetland is uh, inundated with water, the, the more likely it is to take on kind of characteristics of, of lake habitats. An ideal wetland is kind of a hemi-marsh situation, about a 50-50 split between emergent vegetation and open water. And that's where the occasional drought period is useful. Here's why. That drought really will knock back succession in those systems and uh, really bring in, uh, you know, a diversity in plants again, annual plants that are good seed producers for waterfowl. And also, uh, it'll bring back uh, diversity in your invertebrate communities as well. What happens is some of the nutrients contained in the decaying plant matter at the bottom of these sloughs is allowed to oxidize and allowed to recharge this emergent vegetation, kind of like adding fertilizer to your lawn. The emergent vegetation provides a lot of food resources for the waterfowl. It also provides great cover sources for uh, nesting waterfowl as well. When water returns, these rejuvenated sloughs provide not only more habitat-rich areas for ducks and geese to raise their young, they should also provide waterfowlers more great areas to hunt. This is Tom Jensen, Outdoors.